Welcome back strangers, today we're going to discuss the Black Knight satellite conspiracy theory that claims NASA is covering up the existence of a 13,000 year old alien satellite that orbits and monitors the Earth. The theory goes that in 1899, Nikola Tesla, the famous inventor and electrical engineer, intercepted radio signals unlike any of the natural radio sources on Earth. He believed the signal was coming from an intelligent life on Mars using radio waves to communicate using a number system as their language. In 1927, Jorgen Halls, a Norwegian engineer, was experimenting with radio signals and discovered some of the signals would echo back to him several seconds later. He could not explain the delayed echoes, but Black Knight enthusiasts believed that he was picking up signals that were being bounced back from the alien satellite. In 1954, UFO researcher Donald Kehoe told newspapers that the U.S. Air Force had detected signals coming from two potential satellites orbiting Earth, despite there being no known man-made satellites in orbit yet. In the early 1960s, Time reported that an unknown object was discovered to be in a polar orbit around Earth. This unexplained object was supposedly monitoring U.S. and Soviet satellites that were in an equatorial orbit. After the report was made public, the U.S. Department of Defense announced that this unknown object was simply a piece of the Discovery 8 satellite launcher that had been drifting in space. Duncan Lunan, a science communicator and science fiction author, attempted to determine the origin of these mysterious radio waves that Tesla and Halls had encountered. He determined in 1973 that the signals were messages transmitted by an alien probe that had been sent from the star system Epsilon Bootis that had been lurking near the moon for the past 13,000 years. The most cited and recent evidence of the existence of the Black Knight satellite comes from the 1998 STS-88 encounter. The crew of the space shuttle Endeavour photographed an unusual object in a low Earth orbit. However, the famous photographs are of an object that are not in the theorized polar orbit of the Black Knight satellite. However, NASA claims that this unknown object was only a thermal blanket that had been dislodged during a previous EVA mission. The Black Knight theory has always fascinated me. The idea that a 13,000 year old alien artifact is watching over humanity like the monoliths of the 2001 Space Odyssey is so amazing and oddly comforting. Knowing that not only are we not alone in the universe, but instead we are being watched over by a higher species. Sadly, it more likely appears that the story of an artificial alien satellite may only be a combination of many unrelated stories. The name Black Knight comes from a British rocket program that was developed to test re-entry vehicles from 1958 to 1965. This project never put a satellite into orbit and is only related to the Black Knight satellite theory in name only. None of the original stories relating to the theory use the term Black Knight in their first publications. Brian Duncan of the Skeptoid Podcast believes that the mysterious radio signals that Tesla discovered in 1899 were the result of pulsars, caused by highly magnetized rotating neutron or white dwarf stars that emit a beam of electromagnetic radiation that can be observed when the beam is pointed at Earth. The unknown object in polar orbit in the 1960s that the U.S. Department of Defense claimed to be debris from Discovery 8 may actually have been the first Corona spy satellite that was put into a polar orbit to spy on Russian military complexes. Duncan Lunin, who originated and helped perpetuate the ancient alien probe or satellite theory, later retracted his conclusions as unscientific and made with outright errors. Despite these facts and rebuttals to the Black Knight satellite theory, do you still think that NASA and the governments of the world are hiding the existence of intelligent alien life? Let us know your theories of the Black Knight satellites in the comments below. If you enjoy conspiracy videos, be sure to like this video so we know you want to see more. Don't forget to subscribe, smash that bell button so you don't miss more of our videos. We release videos every week and have a couple of really interesting videos planned for next week. So until next time, stay strange.